Madonna, apart from being one of the world's most iconic singers, is also a devoted mother. She has six kids and shares a daughter with Lord Leon and a son, Rocco Ritchie, with Guy Ritchie, but they aren't close. In addition to that, Madonna has four children she adopted from Malawi on three different occasions. Madonna wanted to be a mother, and Malawi wasn't open to letting a foreigner adopt a Malawian child. This is the shocking truth about the boy Madonna adopted 17 years ago. You see, Malawi remains one of the most poorest countries in the world despite making significant economic and structural reforms. The country is dependent on agriculture, which employs 80% of the population and the country is vulnerable to external shocks, particularly climate shocks. The development of the country is hindered by a fast-growing population, limited arable land, natural disasters, food insecurity, HIV AIDS, and malaria. It is estimated that 50% of the population is under the age of 15, and a large number of these young people are living in poverty, and David was one of them. The adoption law in Malawi restricts foreigners to adopt a child unless they've resided in Malawi for at least a year and a half, and time was of the essence for the singer as she had a lot of international obligations and she could not spend a year in Malawi. Soon Madonna's lawyers would find a new loophole in the local adoption laws, and finally she was allowed to take David to his new home. But, the news wanted a spicy headline, so they blew it out of proportion. The news alleged that Madonna was kidnapping kids from Malawi. They claimed she wasn't saving a life, but separating a child from his family. It was because David wasn't an orphan, he has a father. This was enough for the media, but as the truth unfolded, it was revealed that David was born in poverty and his life was drenched by tragedy. More often than not, whatever these celebrities do gets highlighted and mostly comes off as a publicity stunt, but... Do you think that's the case for Madonna as well? David's logical mother died a week after giving birth to him. This was a sad occurrence in the family, but there was more to come as David's father, Johanna Banda, was drowning in debt. David, the little boy who was 18 months old, was fighting pneumonia. These were harsh moments and so Johanna had no other choice but to give the child up and send him to an orphanage. That was when the boy met the iconic American singer, who would soon be his mother, but the media had the brightest idea of sacrificing the facts and creating catchy headlines. These headlines always had the narrative that Madonna had kidnapped David. But that was just the beginning. During her time in Malawi, in her efforts to adopt her son, she met a 4-year-old girl named Mercy. The little girl was suffering from malaria and her mom had tragically passed away, and so she was placed in the orphanage. When Madonna met Mercy, she was broken, and so she decided to take the little girl in and give her a new home with a family every child deserves. She went on to talk to the officials on Malawi, but it wasn't as smooth as you'd think it'd be. This one was more challenging than David's adoption. Malawian officials denied Madonna's request to adopt the little girl and become her mother. They said it was because a divorce of women isn't fit to raise a child on her own. This was not logical for Madonna, and it was even sexist to give such a reason. Why do you think the Malawian officials were so hell-bent on not letting Madonna adopt? This motivated her to hire a team of lawyers and take her case to the Supreme Court. A simple adoption and dead up changing the whole Malawian ad adoption system. The adoption laws in Malawi had not been changed or revised for 60 years, but when Madonna began working her way through the adoption, it changed everything. Some women have been raising children for centuries on their own, and they don't need a man to do it. Even Madonna herself was doing just fine raising three children. She has resources that are more than enough to take care of the kids. The adoption lawsuit happened for about four years, and eventually, Madonna won, and now Mercy's living with her. Madonna became the mother and gave her the loving family she oh so deserved, and so she began thinking of different ways to help more kids in Malawi. During her time in Malawi for a long time besides the case, she was also shocked to see so many kids suffering. She couldn't take all of them home, but she wanted to help as many as possible. It was not as easy to push through, and it took Madonna almost 10 years to achieve her dream. Finally, in 2017, she adopted twin sisters, Esther and Stella, but she now had to talk to her children about this decision, and Mercy and David were more than happy to have more Malawians in the house. Today, David Banda has become equally talented as his mom, as he was seen with Madonna walking hand in hand into a boxing match in Brooklyn. Mercy has become a great skateboarder, and beside her sporting talents, she also has a knack for playing the piano. As for the youngest, the twins are currently learning music, and they look up to Mercy as their big sister. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more interesting videos. Have a good day.